Hello and welcome. I'm Kimberly Davis and I'm here to tell you about the seam. How many people in this room right now are like me and have two, three, or maybe just one email in your inbox right now that you got sometime last week and were meaning to get around to it? Many of us have too many emails and just not enough time. If you're one of those people, I have good news for you. There's an app for that. The name of this great app is The Seam, and it was designed with you in mind as a tool to help you keep in touch with fellow employees, partners, and friends of Shaw Industries. Today we will cover how to download The Seam, how to customize your experience to suit you, and how to like and share. Here we go. The first thing you want to do is download The Seam app. The Seam is available in App Store and Google Play. We will use Play Store. In order to search for the scene, you're going to enter the underscore scene. This is all lowercase letters and no spaces. Again, that was the underscore scene, all lowercase and no spaces. You'll be able to identify the app by a signature logo, which is a red cloud. Next, you will hit install to download the app. Once the app is downloaded, you'll open the app and hit get started. Once you have downloaded and installed the app, you will want to log in using your employee ID and show me password. Next, you will be asked to accept notifications and to your plant number and accept push notifications. You'll want to be sure to accept the push notifications so that you don't miss out on anything important. So here's a quick review of what we've just done. We downloaded the Scene app using App Store or Google Play. We searched for the Scene using all lowercase and no caps, the underscore Scene. We were able to identify the correct app by the Red Cloud logo. Next, we installed the app and remember to push notifications so that we would not miss anything important. Now that you've downloaded the scene, you are ready to explore, like, and share. On your scene homepage, you will have three tabs across the top. These are the My Feed tab, the Explore tab, and the Highlights tab. The My Feed tab is a real-time running feed to help you stay abreast of what's going on at Shaw. Posts in the feeds are called content cards. At the top of each content card, you will see the name of the channel that it comes from. This particular card came from the 50th anniversary channel. At the bottom of each content card, you will have the option to like or share. In order to like a content card, you will simply touch the heart button in the bottom left hand corner of the content card. If you would like to share a content card, you simply touch the share icon in the right hand corner and then you have the option to share the content on the social media app of your choice. In addition to sharing the content of others, you also have the option to share a content card of your own. In order to create your own content card, you will hit the blue pen and pad icon in the right hand corner of the bottom of your screen. That takes you to a submit post screen. On this screen, you can add a photo by selecting the gray mountain icon in the center of your screen. That takes you to the option to choose an existing photo or take a new photo. For this demonstration, we will choose an existing photo. Select the photo of your choice, click it once, and then you go to a crop screen where you can move the box up or down to select how much of your photo you would like to post. Once you've determined how much of your photo to post, simply click the checkbox in the top right hand corner of your screen. Next, you have options to add text to your photo. By clicking in the description box, you should pull up your phone's keypad and from there you can add text to your photo. When you are done, hit the right hand corner's arrow and you are taken to select channels. From there, you can select which of the channels you would like your post to show up on. For this demonstration, we will do app tips and tricks. Simply select the checkbox and hit confirm. Next, you hit the right hand arrow again. 
and your post has been added to the Shaw scene. Once the scene operators approve your photo, it will later post to the channel you have selected. Remember any time that you share a content card on social media, remember to use the hashtag the Shaw scene. Also, a good rule of thumb is to never post anything online that you wouldn't want to be on the front of tomorrow's paper. We also encourage you not to text and drive. Now let's take a look at the second tab on the home page. The second tab on the home page is the Explore tab. The Explore tab gives you a preview of the channel lineup of all of the channels available on the Shaw scene. Each channel contains content cards that pertain directly to the channel's title. By clicking anywhere in a channel's box, you can preview the content cards that are available for that channel. Next, you can click the back button and then you have the option to follow or unfollow any of the channels. To follow, you simply click the follow button beneath the channel's title and you will see the following button turn to blue. This lets you know that you have that channel followed. If you later decide to unfollow any channels, you simply return to your explore tab and then click the blue following buttons, they will turn back to clear and these channels are no longer followed. By using the Shaw Explore tab, you have the option to make Shaw Scene work for you. The Explore tab puts more of the information that you want in the palm of your hands with just a touch of a few buttons. The Highlight tab features content cards that are recommended for all Shaw employees. While we want you to have the freedom to customize your experience using the Explore tab, we do give you the option to take a look at some of the cards that we think are best for you. By choosing the highlight cards, you can come in and take a look at posts from other employees, partners, and friends at Shaw. We hope you enjoy this app as much as we do, and we encourage you to explore, like, and share. So here's what we've done today. We downloaded the scene. We now know how to explore and follow channels. We can like and share our favorite content. And we are ready to go. Thanks for watching. I'm Timberly Davis, and this is the Shaw Scene.